Hello guys, welcome back to BBB channel. In this video, we'll be talking about Manamas again and I'm going to teach you how to enhance your security on your Manamas using these six steps. Okay, so first of all, right, very easy. You will need to install your Manamas under your Brave browser. Okay, so how to go to Brave browser, you just need to search Brave browser. Okay, and you will see this. Okay, so um, Manamas, they support um, a few features under the um, Google Chrome Brave browser, Microsoft Edge, and also Firefox. Okay, so first, the first step will be do not log in your Manamas on a shared computer or even a public Wi-Fi such as um, on, in your workplace or in school because um, under the shared network, people may be able to access the information on your computer or even um, create like key logger on your computer where they are able to retrieve your secret phrase and to head into your Manamas wallet. Okay, so next right, you will need to write down your Manamas seed phrase that you adopt when you are creating the account on a notepad or um, and place it somewhere in your safe or somewhere safe la. okay you can like write it down under you must physically write it down on your notepad or even on your paper and keep it somewhere okay and try not uh, and do not lose it because once you lose your seed phrase you will be not able to retrieve your wallet anymore okay so and next thing right you will need to once you like browse your metamask right so how to add your extension under your brave browser you just need to click on pin and there will be this uh, metamask icon here so for example if you are doing on um pancake swap which is under the binance smart chain right um okay so you need to okay so once you log into your um wallet or you connect to your um pancake swap or even any any DeFi projects right you can what you need to do is um try lock your wallet when it is not in use la. so for example if you are finished doing your staking under your binance on under your pancake swap right you can just click on the manamas wallet and click on lock okay so that so how to click on lock you just need to click on your this profile icons and there's this lock button and you just lock it lock out okay so once you lock out every time you lock in you will need to key in your password and you unlock again then you can lock in that is the third one third suggestion which is lock your Manamas account when you are not in use okay so the password that you are locking into your Manamas which is this right you um, have to change something that is more encrypted like using asterisk or even uh, numbers okay asterisk or numbers such as these icons la. okay these icons to enhance your password so that hackers will make it harder for them to um, hack into your account okay like these symbols or even numbers okay um, so that is the fourth tip and the fifth tip will be disconnect the site when you find suspicious after connecting so for example if you connect to a website right let me log in again uh. so for example if you connect to your um, pancake shop already and you, and you find that oh um, I I find it dangerous under pancake shop and I want to disconnect the site so what you need to do is you can just go to your Manamas and there's disconnected right you can just go to um, the three dots here click on it and there's disconnected slide and you click on it and you click on this disconnect recycle bin icons okay and you can disconnect so once you disconnect in order to reconnect your wallet back right you will need to um, key in your password for example here yeah then you can connect again okay so this is one way to help you um, disconnect the site when you find it suspicious after connecting your hub, your wallet and the last number six will be um, to use your hardware wallet so how to connect your hardware wallet you will need to go to your metamask again and click on the three dots right oh sorry you click on here and there's this connect hardware wallet okay 
and you can click on uh, whether your hardware wallet is it Ledger or Trezor if you are using Ledger you just click on Ledger and you need to install Ledger Live and you click on continue and connect the USB to your uh, Ledger and connect your hardware wallet into your MetaMask okay and so this is how it works yeah so this is how um, you can enhance your security on your MetaMask the uh, first step will be do not lock in um, do not lock in your MetaMask on the shared computer or on the public Wi-Fi such as um, your workplace or even school and secondly will be write down your seed phrase on notepad and not digital online or even your google doc or even uh, your google drive okay you need to physically write down on the paper or even the notepad and place it somewhere that you are able to retrieve easily third one will be to lock your MetaMask wallet when you are not in use such as here okay so you need to lock when you are not in use and um use an uh, encrypted password to use it as the blocking password for your MetaMask okay and the next is to disconnect site that you find that um, the site is suspicious okay so that to prevent your hackers from connecting the site from the website to your MetaMask wallet and last but not least um, to enhance additional layers of security is to buy is connecting your hardware wallet into your MetaMask either using Ledger or Treasure okay so that's all for today's video if you like this video remember to like and share and subscribe to our channel and I shall see you in the next BBP video thank you for watching see you and bye bye hello guys First of all, welcome to our channel. If you enjoy our videos, please like and comment below. Don't forget to click on the bell icons and remember to subscribe and click here for more videos.